Hello, we're here to show how the free mail software from MechSoft Corporation can be used with the CNC um, burn tables machine with the router attachment. Um, I've already gone through and drawn a sphere in the CAD portion of the program. It's two inches in diameter. Um, and then what I'm going to go through is how to go through the free mail application of uh, putting it to a g-code for the burn tables to be able to use. Um, all you have to do is go through these settings here to set up uh, how the program is going to write the code with your machine settings. Um, you use a world, world Z coordinate system and then you create uh, basically your stock size or how big your piece is. Um, I'm just going to say it's an inch bigger on um, X and Y and the Z I'm not too worried about because I want to start the Z um, zero point from the top of the material and in this part I set the work zero set to the top of the stock box um, and then you know zero face high Z you know if you change it you can see where the zero part comes on but the easiest thing to do is just um, put it on the top of the the material so you just bring the router down and zero off the um, top of your material the zero position zero, you can do it any other, um, you know, northeast or northwest center um, for me will work great in this application. Then I want to do a create uh, cutting tool. I have a bull bit that I'm going to use, which is um, about uh, 3 eighths in di diameter, 3 eighths flute length um, until it's the tool length. And then cutting speeds. I'm going to cut this out of foam, so 40 inches per minute on all the feed rates should be good. And then I'm um, going to create the machining operation, uh, cut direction along the Z, which is fine. Um, and then what I can do is generate it, and it will show you exactly what it will be doing in the operation. Um, then to the post pro uh, operation window, um, just select the post you're going to use, which for the bird tables it uses a code of Mach 3 inches. and then you post it. So when you post it, what you end up with is a G-code file that you can load into the bird tables program, which I'm going to select the sphere here, and then it gives you a, a preview, and I have the detail of how many um, cut lines it's going to do very um, small, so you get the maximum detail. Um, if I just want to rough cut it, I can make that spacing between the pass um, a lot bigger. And then basically after you zeroed out the machine on the top of the material, you hit cycle start and you'll see the machine to start moving and start to cut in, um, cut the sphere out. Um, after this is done, um, uh, your sphere, sphere is complete. 